A patron was shot and killed during an armed robbery at a bar in Top Hill in St. Elizabeth on Saturday morning. Details about the incident remain unclear, but information reaching Observer Online is that the patron was at the bar drinking about 1 a.m. when armed robbers pulled up on the establishment. The man reportedly refused to give them any money and he was gunned down. The deceased has not yet been officially identified. The robbers reportedly were about were able to make off with 7,000 from gambling boxes at the establishment. Observer Online reported earlier this week that there had been a spate of robberies along the south coast of St. Elizabeth. An 18-year-old man has been charged with the murder of a man who was mobbed and chopped on Burke Road in Old Hour St. Catherine on Saturday, July 1. Dead is 47-year-old Jason Davis, otherwise called Toby, or Kevin, a laborer of Bodles Crescent, Old Arbor in the parish. Charged with murder and conspiracy to murder is Russian Freeman, otherwise called Benji of North Street, Old Harbor, St. Catherine. Reports are that about 2.20 p.m., Freeman and his accomplices mobbed and inflicted chop wounds on Davis. Davis was taken to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. An investigation was launched and Freeman was arrested. Following an interview session in the presence of his attorney, he was charged. A man accused of fatally stabbing his brother during an altercation in Delacree Park housing scheme in Kingston on Sunday, July 16, has been charged with murder by detectives assigned to the Hunts Bay Criminal Investigation Branch. Dead is 33-year-old Sean Palmer, a bearer of Delacree Park housing scheme in the parish. Charged is 25-year-old Jonathan Davis of the same address. Reports are that about 1.20 p.m. Davis and Palmer were at home when an argument developed between them. During the altercation, Davis used a knife to inflict wounds on, the, on Palmer's upper body. Palmer then ran from the house in a bid to seek assistance. However, he collapsed. He was taken to hospital where he died whilst undergoing treatment. A report was made to the police and Davis was arrested. He was charged after he underwent an interview session in the presence of his attorney. His court date has not been finalized.